Hello, hello everyone. How's your Sunday going? I hope and wish it's going exactly as you planned. How's mine? I'm kicking it off by posting this episode. While the basil is fresh and my promise to come back and post an episode on how to make basil pesto is fresh in y'all's memory, I wanted to get back to you. So here we are. Buckle up for a delicious recipe on how to make basil pesto with homegrown Thai basil. Follow along, try this recipe and do let me know in the comment section how it worked out for you and how you all like it. Especially how your kiddos like it. That is the garlic pod which I harvested from Nandanavanam earlier this season. I used this blender as it's transparent and I thought it would be easier for me to share with you all. In hindsight, I should have used my regular blender. Why? You'll know about it during the review time. It's time to pick basil which I left in the water and separate the leaf from the stem. It's important to let them dry out as we do not want any additional water in our pesto. Why are we separating the leaf from the stem? That is because we also want to use the stem. It has a lot of flavor in it. Just that stems will need an extra grind to fit in. And that's why I want to separate them from the leaf. You can use a regular kitchen towel to absorb the excess water from the basil leaf. I am using something special though. This is the receiving blanket of our first child. To celebrate its service to our family, Surabi will do the honors too. <laughs> Obviously, this is my first time making pesto, so I had no idea that a whole lot of basil will turn into very little pesto. So I ended up using a little too much salt. So you want to use only half as much salt that I did.
Taste tester. Yes. Come. Okay. You have to taste pesto. Okay. This shows up way brighter than it actually is on camera. How is it? Salty. Salty? Mm-hmm. Okay. But how is the flavor? Really good, Nama. Is it too salty? Yeah, but I like too salty, so. But, okay. But the texture could be better. It's a bit too rough. Like okay. the other one, before we, you added the basil, it was too watery. Mm -hmm. But like, it should become the like consistency of like thick chutney. Yeah. So. Okay. Better luck next time, I guess then. Yeah. Um, I would rate it a 6 out of 10. I can't hear you. Okay, wait. 6 out of 10. This Why is... Why screaming? Because you said louder. I can hear you. Why are you screaming? 6 out of 10. What? Nana! Hey, <laughs> don't beat me. Okay, what is it again? 6 out of 10. Why are you screaming? try them out and do let me know how they worked out for you. If you like these quick and easy recipes, please smash the thumbs up button. When you all hit the thumbs up button, YouTube recommends these videos to a larger audience and that way you can help me out and grow the channel. Please do not forget to subscribe to the channel for more interesting videos. Until next time, this is Pavan signing off and thank you.